So uh, we're here on the northwest side of Curacao. Just to get you up to speed, I'm here. We're at Go West Diving. We're about to do our two take dive. It's seven o'clock in the morning. We're about an hour early, but we're probably just gonna explore a bit and you know, get ready to dive.
first dive complete. We in it, baby. I'm ready. For my ears off. Yeah. That's it. What is this shit, bang?
Oh boy, this shit bangin' oh. Time. Always his time. Yo, my computer started beeping. It started going. I'm actually happy. I'm really happy with my. Right, good. Yeah, you stay. Yeah, you did. You're right there. You're I, tried to, I tried a trick to do is just slip around her. Don't do. Don't be vertical. I have to slim horizontally around her. I'm so pissed. Up. I was worried. I thought I was gonna get the bend. Okay, you can go back down. Huh? How many more you think you got? I can't. I can't you can't. can't. What you go? Up? Can't. Oh yeah. Sure.
On our last dive, we actually went to Lake, if you go on the internet, they'll say they'll call like the best dive site in Curacao, it's called Watamula, and uh, it's like a reef that goes down a slope. Um, I went, my buddy Brian didn't make it because he was, uh, wasn't feeling well from the night before. Uh, this was an afternoon dive, and on this dive, I got down to about 63 feet, which so was the deepest dive that I've done uh, here while in Curacao, but it was absolutely gorgeous. The reef was amazing. There's fish uh, everywhere. We actually had a couple that was diving that actually went line fishing, line fish, spear fishing. Uh, they caught a couple of couple of spear uh, line fish. Um, I've actually never had line fish, but hopefully on my next trip I can I can experience that because I also want to do spear fishing as well.